Hello there. there. I'm Robert. And, I'm and we are late to the party and we're trudging through Arcane. I can't believe we're already at episode seven. Yeah, it's been a wild ride so far. I'm liking everything that we are seeing. This, the imagery, the, you know, the animation style, uh, the, the way that they, sh- you know, animate it with the shots and everything is of course is great it's got a visual style all in its own very reminiscent of the don bluth era but so much more it's like its own thing just in terms of the beauty and the effort that they do put into a lot of these crazy ass shots right. but the characters as well the characters are definitely what are bringing us back to this show and right now it's a bit of a mess we've got uh, vi getting kidnapped by the firelights of yes. course jinx does have a little bit of uh, powder in there there. Even though she says she washed it all away, there's a hint. As soon as she saw Vi, but it was Caitlyn that kind of kicked it back in the Jinx direction. Right, and then of course Vi realizing what has happened to her, or to have powder or Jinx, sure. um, when she's like laying waste to the firelight. And she's just getting a good look of what happened to her little baby sister. Yeah, That's probably your fault, man. You freaking slapped her or socked her. She, she hit her, and that broke her heart to the to running into the hands of Silco, right. uh, who survived Buster Keaton style in that last episode. Yeah. But uh, no clue where it's going to go from here. Of course, we've got some craziness going on, too, with Jace and Victor yeah. and Piltover. And, and there's just so much drama, and I love it. But, guys, if you want to check out our full episode watch-alongs and early access to the next episode, they're available on our Patreon. And if you have not subscribed, please do so. Click the subscribe button and the notification bell so you know when these drop. We have so many other things coming. Uh, The last episode of Hawkeye. Then we've got Book of Boba Fett coming. Uh, We've got the uh, Peacemaker in January. Cobra Kai is on its way. Cobra Kai. We've got, uh, I was going to say Army of the Dead, but we got Alice in Borderland and The Boys. So there's a lot. There is the most we've ever done in one month yeah. happening right now on the channel. So make sure you sub so you don't miss it. But guys, let's get into episode seven of Arcane now. Ooh. Nice. Oh, damn. <laughs> yeah, we're getting some firelight love. Oh, jeez. Yeah, we saw your maneuvers. We know you guys are pimp. <laughs> this just solidifies it. This is like third music video. Join us. Although I have seen you guys kind of get your butt kicked quite a bit. Yeah. Jinx herself has eliminated a few of you. It took her they too. They took both of yeah. them. Yeah. This isn't Silco. It's someone else. Your lunatic sister works for him. Just as soon as you came clean about what the hell you're really doing down here. POV style. That's all they get. That's yeah. what we get. Oh, What's going go. on? Let me go! Bye! Uh, Bye. Damn, man. That was cool. That was different. Good for a dead girl. Damn. Is that I forgot how they like gave him a nickname, Little Man or Big Man or something? Like oh that? fuck! Are you shitting me? That, From yeah, the little kid that knows all and listens to all, and he yeah. was he had his hands and everything. Yeah. Oh damn! Holy shit! Or was it like Echo or something? I can't even remember his name. Oh maybe Echo. Maple, yeah. I forgot about him. Yeah. Echo? Yeah! yeah! Hell yeah! <laughs> Got his ear to the ground. About this. Dang. Nothing. And what she the doesn't. What is this all about? It's me, Vi. That was a long time ago. Nah, man. Mm. People change. It's true. Yeah, I'm getting that. Are you working for Silco? Fuck you. <laughs> he turned into like the Robin Hood of Zon. Yeah. You still block with your face. <laughs> That's what boxers do. Oh, damn. Yeah, you guys have a pass that runs deep. Yeah. Oh, Victor. The subjects wither and rot. Poor Rio. We have the capacity to change our nature. The good shit. Not like the stuff they have down in the under-under city. This is the peer shit. I must warn you. Look at that glisten in his eyes. Now the legacy are the sacrifices we make for progress. It's why I parted ways with Heimendinger. Interesting. So he used to work with him? I guess so. Oh, 
I mean, all Tony right. Stark over here. Yeah, look at this. Except putting on a show. <laughs> there you go. With those lap pulls. <laughs> I guess so. Look at that. Jeez. Ooh, Pretty come sure on, that's man. a Pilates machine. I just now realized that's Jace. Uh, you didn't even realize that. <laughs> I knew it was Jace. A delicate art. How'd you find me? Dang, man. No wonder they're all clamoring for him in I the know, streets. Right? I tried taking it apart and it nearly killed me. Whoever built it knows exactly what they're doing. She rigged him, too. Is that what's really bothering you? No, it's Victor. He's like, I'm pregnant. Uh -huh. <laughs> it's your time now, Jace. No more red tape. Once it all goes bad, too, he's going to go running back to Heimerdinger. In the meantime, Ooh. try not to lose your nuts. Ooh. As a double entendre. Yeah. Though. She know what she doing. It was kind of low hanging fruit, though. Didn't oh, she was dead. Course. She's still alive. She's like falling apart as we go. It's like Eric Idle's character in European Vacation. Let's just say I didn't always see eye to eye with my old man. You got daddy issues, huh? Never would have guessed. Need a tissue for your daddy issues? And there she's That's talking picture, to him. Yeah. Why right. would I remember her name? The Shattered Mind. Uh. Mirror in the back. Jesus. Get Laugh him. away the pain. Kill it all. Ooh, sanctuary. Is that a real tree? Pretty cool, huh? Like Peter Pan and the Lost Boys. Yeah. <laughs> She's still in there. I can reach her. You can't. We saw it. She let her hug her. Yeah. I got one more thing to show you. I'm liking his hair. Yeah, it's, I mean, it's a great glow up, you know, from the little kid to what would he look like in this, you know, aged world. Yeah. Looks pretty legit. Your sister works for him not because she has to, but because she wants to. It's a beautiful memorial. Yeah. Now she's still there. It wasn't until Caitlyn showed up that she flipped her lid. True. Dang. Here we go again. Clashes. What are you going to do? I order a blockade and my own partner violates it. You ordered this? Yep. Well, you didn't say they were from the Undercity. They're dangerous. Oh. But he's from the Undercity. Jace. Yep. I'm sorry. You have to understand there are allies in the Undercity. With bleeding money, and for what? Dude looks like a rat bat gremlin. We aren't due for an assembly. Crime lords coming together. Yeah. It's like their own version of the council. What's your plan to fix this? It's got like a golden mandible. Better to have some trade than none at all. Oh no. oh no, they turned it out. You guys are done. Oh. What's that? He's liquidating the council. Damn. You guys are out. That's why they turned off the fan. Okay. It's a threat, yeah. Stuck in your eyes. But you've grown fat and complacent. It's a real power move. <laughs> real power move. To the brink. Uh. Sorry. Yeah, it's not for you. Oh, there you okay. go. Share, share the wealth. Okay. Don't forget again. Oof. Dang. Yeah. Thought he was gonna. I mean, it's so much more work to just replace him. I guess. Replace yeah. his position. Just show him what's what. Yeah. And send him on his way. Good meeting. <laughs> that plant looks so sad in the background. It's supposed to like represent them, maybe. It's great. It's just doom and gloom. Yeah. It's too soon. Jace isn't ready. Ready for what? Sh is she trying to manipulate him too? Get him to do something. Does she answer to someone? I guess we'll find out. Eventually. Uh, 
I mean, I understand her hesitance. Yeah. But she is an enforcer. It's me, you want. My hero. <laughs> you get a pass back topside. That's it. Oh, damn. Send her on her way. She could be a powerful ally. Same thing with you guys. You don't trust the people on the other side. Yeah. With good reason. But still, you guys can work together. Let me help you with that. I'd be all like, no thanks. <laughs> I got it. <laughs> I'm good. Thanks. Don't move, silly. Marcus never told me she was in Stillwater. You lied. Dude, he's afraid of her. She and the Enforcer are back for the crystal. Not for you. Lies. I mean, the Enforcers were for the crystal, but Vi is for you. Everyone else betrays us. Manipulative son of a bitch. Right over the camera, too. Yeah, geez. So I wonder what that does for him, you know. Maybe keep something at bay? Possibly. You got it. You have to let me take that back. Talk about it. We could beat Silco with this. You don't know what to do with it yet. This city needs healing. More than I ever realized. She got to have a taste of reality down there. Yeah. I have a friend on the council. Nope. Let me take the gemstone to him. Nope, don't trust him. He's the reason why there's these all these things. Yeah, but he's still on the side of trying to help. Maybe. For now. I'm the one who gives it to them. Yeah, he really should be a representative being like, yo, here's this. You need to help us. This is what's happening. We should prepare our own countermeasures. You want us to build weapons? It's always the plan. If we're lucky, we'll never need to use it. Mm-hmm. No, but that's how it starts. The decision is yours. Then you use it, then you use it again. Is the decision really yours, though? <laughs> ooh. Ah, oh, Victor. Ooh, ooh. He's skilled. I need to think. God, everyone's got a dilemma on their hands. Yeah. It's giving my heart palpitations. I don't know what's going to happen. Oh, is he going to do it? He's going to do it. But is he going to turn into like a monster? I don't or know. We'll find out. Just a souped up victor. We call them firelights. Never seen so many, though. Mm. Okay. That's where they get their name. Yeah. Thought she was walking in on him. I I'm know, like, no! I thought so too. You're like, no. In the wrong place. <laughs> yeah. I'm worried I have to do something I never thought I would. Uh, where are you off where to, are Professor? You going, Professor? Maybe the hex text will help. You're gonna add shimmer with the hex tech. Oh no! What are you doing? He's turning magical. Oh damn! He's gonna turn into like a sorcerer. He's already got the crutch. Yeah. He can just turn it into a wand. I can't leave her again. No promises. Splitting the party. Yep. It's been real, cupcake. Thanks. Let's just hope. Oh, no, no, no! Ah! It's just a goodbye hug. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Don't listen to them. There's some voice of reason there for Jinx. Yeah. Not if Jinx is gonna come and just throw. Oh, damn. What the hell is this? Oh, no. Sir, Silco's behind everything. Oh, no. You're trusting the wrong people. <gasps> Echo, you were right! Get out of there! Echo! Oh no! You son of a bitch! Is he okay? <sighs> yeah, please let him be okay. Look like he had armor on. What are you gonna- yeah, what are you gonna do? Oh god. Lie. No! She was gonna go back there. Don't you leave this alone. Oh damn! Look at that! With the fire lights behind her? Yeah, is she gonna they gonna help her? What are they gonna do? What the hell are you doing? Oh no! Oh no! Whoa, 
<laughs> and they were hers. Oh my gosh. Brilliant. Wow. Brilliant little psycho. Ew. She's amazing. Wow. Tell me he's okay. Yeah. Yeah, he's okay, good. He's okay. Whew. <laughs> Doesn't mean nothing to her. Ah. Run away. Damn. Oh my daughter. Oh. They just want to help. Oh, Marcus. She's just going to take it and leave. Don't do it, Jinx. And she's got. Oh! <laughs> Son of a bitch! Oh, God. Oh! That shit back! Oh my god! <gasps> Take it back! Okay. <sighs> I just now realized Caitlyn has blue hair. Yes, she has. She's always had blue hair. I, I get it, but I didn't make the connection with uh, Powder. It makes it worse. The boy savior. Oh shit. Does he have a contingency plan? Oh, damn. Are we going to throw down? Yeah. Oh, please let him survive. Oh, shit. Oh, no! Oh, God, come on, please. The firelight behind him. This is way more intense, too, because it's like... Oh, no. Is he still protected? Oh, no. <laughs> All right. I don't want either of them to win. I know. Or lose. This could be his downfall. No. No, no, no. Was she willing to take herself out, too? No. That's what a wild card would do. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> we just got done, you know, praising the series for their quality of visuals. And then they come out with this episode and just knock it even further out into the park. Every episode, I feel like I'm seeing some crazy shit I've never seen before. Yeah. And it was just beautiful, stylistic, heartbreaking, emotional. Holy shit, it even just had the twist of the fact that she was building the little firelights that were all over the place. Yes, and the fact, though, too, is, like, we only have two episodes left, so it's, like, if these episodes are like this, sure. what are these next two episodes are going to be? Are they going to elevate it to the next level? And it's, like, oh, my God, what's going to happen? What the hell is going on with Victor? I mean, he's hooking up with the hex tech and adding a little bit of his shimmer, uh, the pure shimmer that he got from his doctor friend who happens to be a, a genius when it comes to manipulation and genetics and cross splicing and all kinds of crazy shit. So what is going to happen on that level? Because Victor is almost on death's door. Jace is falling into the traps of the council and bureaucracy and ah, the professor. Who knows where the hell the professor's going? I think the professor has got his own little like syndicate of protectors that Maybe. will probably step up to try and stop what happened before from happening again. I feel like the, the council is, well, more so is just trying to manipulate Jace into doing their bidding without getting their hands dirty. Sure. And they can blame it all on him instead. And that's why, one, their first step was getting the professor out. Yeah. And, and and so they have that done unless, you know, the professor has a way of being like, hey, this is what needs to be done. Sure. Uh, you know, like I said, Victor, what if Victor, like you said, what if Victor is the, the magic user, the wizard? See, OK, so we were talking about it, right? And I broke it down. I was just like, OK. Uh, there's a part that I was watching in the last episode where Victor had his crutch 
And I was like, man, that kind of looks like the thing the sorcerer was swinging around when he was a, a magic user, the mage. And I was like, do, do they have time travel in this thing? So I started wondering, like, maybe he becomes powerful and he went back in time and actually helped Jace. But, you know, hear him with the purple in the hex tech and putting it together. Like, I'm wondering, like, maybe that was him. But no, I could be just running with it. That's the thing is, like, we're sitting here speculating in between episodes because we don't watch them all in one sitting. So we're speculating uh, and and starting to let our minds wander. So it's great when they yeah. completely go away. We don't think they're going to go in the next episode. Right. It keeps us guessing. And I love this show for that. But right. guys, what did you think of this episode? Episode 7 of Arcane. Let us know down in the comments below. You can also like and subscribe. And do the thing on our Facebook, Twitter, Tumblr, Instagram, Discord. All the social networking gin joints, you know where they are. Kick into the party. Feel the party. Keep the party going on our Patreon. Like Vanessa said, we got a lot of shows running at this moment. Check out all the stuff we did from Spider-Man and spoiler reviews and non-spoiler reviews. All that stuff's available on our channel. Subbed if you haven't. And now it's time to say goodbye. And this party's over. Bye.